Hello everyone, my name is Tara G. Welcome to my channel. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. The star of Sister Wives, Mikelty Brown Pedrin, has reportedly turned her back on Robin Brown and is now exposing her lies. The two of them have always given the impression of having a strong connection, leading some admirers to speculate about Mikelty's commitment. Is it possible that everything changed in the twinkling of an eye? Continue reading for further information. Wives who are sisters Mikelty Brown Pedrin turns the tables on Robin and identifies lies despite the fact that she is Christine Brown's daughter. Mikelty Brown Pedrin has maintained her loyalty to Robin Brown throughout her life. During the early stages of their relationship, she shared a home with her father's fourth wife. As for Mikelty, she was welcomed by Robin, and as a result, she went to assist Robin in taking care of her three children. Mikelty maintained her close relationship with the Brown family throughout the years, regardless of what went on with Robin, Kobe Brown, and the rest of the family members. This became a very problematic topic once Christine left the multiple marriage, which resulted in everything being thrown into disarray. Even in the most recent episodes, Mikelty, her daughter Avalon, and her husband Tony Padron all made an attempt to pay Cody and Robin a visit. It was obvious that Cody favored one of his daughters from his previous marriage to his third wife, and this particular daughter was eager to maintain the status quo no matter what. Is it possible that Mikelty has experienced an about face and made the decision to change the ending for Robin Brown? Starcasm reports that the 27-year-old objected to a recent statement that Robin made on Sister Wives about Christine. She asserted that the first time Cody's relationships with his children started to deteriorate was in 2021, after Christine had left the household. At that point, Mikelty Padron turned to her Patreon supporters in order to reveal the truth. You couldn't be more wrong. Long before COVID and even longer before Mom left, the rocky patch in their relationship had already begun. Long, long before, Mikelty elaborated. A moment ago, she did mention that the Robin she sees on the show and the one she knows in real life are not the same person. This came about after she had received notes wondering how she could be so loyal to someone who is so terrible. Due to the fact that she is genuinely rather friendly in real life, she is having a difficult time determining who the genuine Robin is. Confronting the father in spite of the fact that Mikelty Brown Padron appears to respect her father and all of the things he accomplished, it appears that this is not the case. She admitted that she and Cody do not always see eye to eye and that she has no problem pointing up when she thinks he is incorrect. These are simply things that are not visible to fans, but perhaps they need to be. Because of her stance of objectivity with regard to Cody and Robin, she has received a great deal of criticism. Nevertheless, Christine has admitted that her daughter has a very unique bond with Robin in comparison to the rest of the children in the family. Even when Mikelty gave birth to her children, Robin was there to see it. On the other hand, it is wonderful to see Mikelty finally calling out her father's fourth wife when she is spreading lies, as this is something that has been a long time coming. Do you think it's a bad idea for Mikelty to stick close to both her father and Robin? Alternately, are you familiar with the background? Please keep us informed and make sure to watch Sister Wives on Sundays on TLC. The series Sister Wives, what's the scoop on Robin Brown and Logan Brown's relationship? What exactly is going on between Robin Brown and Logan Brown, the actors who play the Browns on Sister Wives? Janelle Brown, Cody Brown's second wife and the mother of Logan, has been estranged from her husband for quite some time. However, it would appear that Robin has enlisted him to assist her in some of her underhanded endeavors. Why is it the case? Continue reading for further information. Wives who are sisters, what's the scoop on Robin Brown and Logan Brown's relationship? The Christmas group chat has been the source of some of the most significant conflicts and dramas throughout season 18. The Brown children have a long-standing tradition of exchanging names and presents between one another. Robin Brown managed to find her way inside, and after determining that the environment was unsafe for her children, she took them out. 
After that, she enlisted the help of Logan Brown, Janelle's son, and Michael T. Brown Pedrin, Christine Brown's daughter, to carry out her evil deeds. Robin wanted them to convey to the other children that her children were no longer involved in the transaction to the other children. Michael T. Brown's choice makes logical given the close relationship she shares with both her father and Robin. But why Logan? It does not appear that he is extremely involved in their lives or that he visits them very frequently, according to what people are aware of. Therefore, why was it necessary for him to tell us this information? Why couldn't she have just requested Michael T. to send a group SMS on her own? And that would have been the end of it? Due to the strange nature of the issue in its entirety, a thread on Reddit has been created to debate it. The original poster posed the following question. Did anyone else find it shocking to learn that Robin had asked Michael T. and Logan to convey to the remaining original siblings that she no longer wished to communicate with them? They were not surprised by Michael T. Brown, but they were curious about the nature of the relationship that existed between Robin and Logan Brown. One person pointed out that Logan had already filled the role of father to Janelle's other children, and because of this, she simply assumed that he would be the greatest choice. Another person concurred and then went on to say, that's what I thought as well. Because she is well aware that the other children look up to Logan, she delegated that responsibility to him. They stated that Michael T. was the one who sent this SMS, therefore, I'm going to assume that Logan turned down the offer. Additional speculation indeed, Logan Brown served as a more involved father figure to all of the children, even Christine Brown's. Gwendolyn Brown, the woman's daughter, stated that her father used to take her to dances when she was a little girl. She also mentioned that if her dad wasn't going to be there to walk her down the aisle, she might ask Logan to do it instead. One user on Reddit expressed the opinion that Logan's siblings respect him sufficiently to tell him the news because he has always been quite level-headed. They also mentioned that Robin is a user, and it was mentioned that she possesses the maturity of a middle schooler. In the end, it appears that Robin and Logan do not have a particularly close relationship and that she merely utilized him for the reason that he had a positive relationship with his brothers. In either case, it was irritating and painful to experience. Do you believe it was inappropriate for her to utilize him and my Kelty Padron in such a manner? Share your thoughts in the section below. And make sure to tune in to Sister Wives every Sunday on TLC. The Brown siblings send a loud and petty message to Mary, Cody, and Robin. In the most recent episode of Sister Wives, Season 18 on TLC, Mary Brown observed that her husband, Cody Brown, was wearing a brand new ring on his finger. Fans are beginning to speculate about whether or not Robin Brown is in on it with him. Or, to put it another way, did she end up purchasing one of the horsey rings? What the heck is wrong with her? Continue reading to find out the opinions of the viewers. Sister Wives Robin Brown disclosed personal information about Mary to Cody Brown. The fact that Cody wore a ring led many to believe that he was trying to draw attention to himself by doing so, and that his last surviving wife had informed him of what Mary was about to talk about. Keep in mind that Mary had already broached the subject of her intentions to relocate to Parowan with her Lularo business with Solomon's mother. Therefore, some users on social media believed that the sister wives patriarch conveyed to Mary a clear message that he no longer considers her to be a significant part of his life. Naturally, TLC viewers were curious as to why Cody would choose a horse to symbolize his feelings for Robin Brown. After all, wild horses are frequently symbolic of being unrestrained. If that was the message that he was sending to Mary, then it felt especially cruel. That his ex-first wife engaged in such nefarious conduct never bothered him in the past is not surprising. This week, people who gathered on social media speculated as to whether or not Robin truly steals the ring in order to celebrate their newly found independence from the other wives. Wives who are sisters' observations of Robin Brown wearing a horse ring, a user named Solomon's mom wore a horse ring, according to a post that appeared on Reddit. The original poster stated that it could be seen in Sister Wives, Season 18, Episode 2. In point of fact, 
it caused them to question whether or not they shared it. Another option would have been for her to lend him her ring, presuming that they could both wear the same size. There is no denying the fact that they both have a horse ring to represent their love. During the subsequent conversation, a few participants insulted Robin Brown by claiming that the animal in question was a donkey and not a horse. The history of how a horse came to represent independence was brought up in conversation once more. Others, meanwhile, recall that Cody spent his childhood on a farm and that both of his parents owned horses. Another participant recounted an early occurrence in which Michael T. climbed upon a horse that she was unable to handle, and her father rescued her. Therefore, it's possible that the sister-wives patriarch has a thing for horses. The TLC audience has decided that both of them have horse rings. Another person who commented on the video remarked that Robin Brown wears it in the intro as well. As a result, they arrived to the conclusion that they definitely bought these replacement wedding rings together. One of the community members voiced their opinion, which was similar to the feelings expressed by others. Such an ugly ring. What are your thoughts on Robin Brown following in the footsteps of her husband by donning a horse ring? Are they passing it around? Or are you of the opinion that they probably both got one to commemorate their monogamous relationship? Leave a comment below to let us know. And make sure to check back here for more Sister Wives spoilers. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay with us.